Now check out the weather with uh, meteorologist Rob Sharp. So we saw some heat um, mm. on Sunday across the nation. Is that going to continue and what's the focus today? Yeah, the focus is now into southwest Queensland where temperatures today and tomorrow will be as high as 45 degrees. So there's considerable heat flowing across the country. I've just looked at the numbers as well and found out that October was the second warmest on record for Australia. It was only really the east around Sydney, for example, that was close to normal for temperatures last month. Uh, but there's been some considerable heat there on the weekend. You got to 29 in Sydney. 31 in Canberra, the warmest in eight months. Uh, but for today, the heat well and truly embedded in central Australia. Uh, but it will flow down again into the southern regions through the next couple of days. So tomorrow, heating up in SA by Wednesday into the southeast for Victoria and Thursday targets Sydney and New South Wales more broadly again before we see that heat build even further for Queensland with a severe heat wave for a number of regions. But for today, there's some patchy light rain over southern and central New South Wales, focusing more towards the coast, maybe for Sydney this afternoon. But showers and storms building north of Sydney through northeast New South Wales, and some of them are going to be severe today. Damaging winds, the main threat, large hail and heavy rain, also a chance today as well in those red shaded regions. Uh, but more broadly across the country, you can see again, hot in the middle, 39 for Alice Springs, warm for Brisbane, but a little bit cooler for the southeast corner. Uh, but looking ahead to tomorrow, there'll be a lovely day for Melbourne Cup day through Victoria with still some showers and cool southerlies for Sydney and further north with some storms again up around the border of New South Wales and Queensland tomorrow but uh, for the running in the Melbourne Cup 27 degrees and sunny. Sounds good thanks Rob.